I think it's really important that we have rules and regulations and transparency so that wherever anybody accepts hospitality, we know what's happened. But with Scott Benton, what you've seen is a flagrant disregard of those rules, of those principles. And it's not a one-off. Only a few weeks ago, we saw three other Tory MPs uh, looking after lucrative jobs, thousands of pounds at a time for their apparent advice. And I think all of this shows that the Prime Minister's lost a grip. Um, and, you know, if ever we needed further evidence, this is it, that Tory sleaze is back. Would you support a new law banning under 25s from betting more than £2 a spin on the slot machine? I think we need to look at whatever proposals the government put forward. The last legislation was nearly 20 years ago now, and online gambling has now come along, it's exploded, and we haven't got proper regulations. So we do think regulations need to be tightened. We'll look at what the government puts forward. But in answer to the question, do we think this needs an update um, and further regulation, then yes, we do. MPs say they're not expecting the government to heed campaigners' calls for a total ban on gambling advertising. Uh, is that something you'd like to see? Well, I think we need to look at what proposals the government put forward. I do think that nearly 20 years after large legislation, it is time uh, to look again to tighten those regulations. I think there's a real concern about online gambling. This wasn't really such a big thing 20 years ago. It's now huge. Um, and there are all sorts of examples that need much, much tighter regulation. Wasn't it New Labour that relaxed gambling laws in this country in the first place? Well, New Labour, back when in the day, were regulating a different environment. The landscape has changed. But I have to say that... Uh, this constant uh, attempt by the government to sort of blame the last Labour government for everything, it really doesn't work. If you've been in power for 13 years, I think the public say, well, look, if there's a problem, you really should have fixed it by now.